And then the flip side, what are the two nutrients that you have to be careful of taking because they become very toxic? Number one, calcium. As we age, calcium tends to plug everything up. And guess what? Magnesium is the regulator of that. And so if you don't take magnesium enough on a regular basis, you're going to put yourself at risk for heart disease. Why? Because you don't have the controlling factor of calcium and it gets into the soft tissues. And then the other nutrient that's even more deadly than too much calcium is too much iron. We have a extreme difficulty in getting rid of iron. At the very most per day, we only get rid of 0.5 to 1 milligram of iron. Yet the RDA for iron is 8 milligrams. And if you're women of childbearing age, it's like 18 milligrams. We're taking in way too much iron. If you have too much iron, you're going to rust out your organs. You want to start looking at labels, start avoiding certain things to make sure you don't overload yourself with iron. Even if you have a genetic problem with iron, which is the person really is not deficient in iron. They just have an accumulation of iron in the wrong place. Iron is very, very toxic and I never recommend taking it in a supplement. Next mistake is to avoid salt. There's a difference between sea salt and table salt. I always recommend sea salt because sea salt has 84 minerals. If someone is salt sensitive, in reality, they're just deficient in potassium because potassium and sodium work together. And we need a considerable amount of sodium. And you get that from sea salt. 